Hi, I'm Bill Hansen, and I'm the Director of Marketing at IBA's Particle Therapy Group. Today I want to share with you a little bit about what protons are all about in the treatment of cancer. And I also want to share with you some innovations that IBA is doing in this growing market. Proton therapy is regarded as one of the most advanced treatments for cancer in the radiotherapy market. Because of its unique characteristics, proton therapy allows you to target the cancer cells directly, killing those cells without harming the healthy tissue around the tumor. Because of that, patients have few to zero side effects and have the benefit of much healthier and higher quality of life after the treatment. Sadly, many patients are, are unable to get the treatment with proton therapy because of the lack of access to the centers around the world. Although there are a number of centers that have been built in the world, the demand for treatment of protons far outweighs the amount of treatment centers available. I'd like to introduce to you one of IBA's latest innovations in this growing market. The Proteus One is a compact single treatment room solution that will make getting into protons much easier for many people. Its unique design starts with a smaller proton accelerator combined with a compact gantry. The system is about one-third the size of a conventional system of today and will fit into approximately the same space as two LINAC rooms side by side. The treatment room is designed with the patient in mind. It is spacious, carefully designed with ambient lighting, making the treatment experience more accessible to the patient and the clinician and more comfortable for the patient during treatment. Proteus One is designed from the ground up with advanced imaging, including stereoscopic x-rays for two-dimensional positioning and integrated cone beam CT into the head for advanced three-dimensional imaging. Proteus One is just one example of the innovations IBA is developing to help bring proton therapy closer to home. Thank you.